Well, Vaughn, uh, I guess that's a really exciting update from you. I'm really glad that you're moving on. Uh, well, not moving on, but you you have a really great opportunity ahead of you, and I hope it leads to really great opportunities in the future. It's really exciting stuff. Hopefully, we can hear some more about your travels in New Orleans in the future, perhaps next week. There's a today, there's a podcast booth in my office. Oh shit! Are I might be able to. Well, I might ask them if like, hey, can, can I record on this podcast? <laughs> that would be crazy. It's just one of our audio is just professional, and then yeah. my audio is just shit. <laughs> comparatively at least i hope you guys enjoy our audio i feel like it's it's certainly better than some audio that i've heard especially coming out of these this uh past year and this current year of, of podcasting where everyone where had to record from home everybody has a podcast for whatever reason and then and also, three quarters yeah. of the people are like airpods are fun yeah airpods are fine I, I've been recording on this professional microphone at my job for the past, and I, I didn't consider buying a, a, a $100 mic or whatever it is. You can, you can buy a $20 microphone and make it sound good uh, if you do a little tweaking. So a USB, all you need is a USB microphone. So it's what we're using currently. So it's just like I, and I, I cannot believe some of them and I will point out IGN specifically. I listened to the Nintendo voice chat, a podcast I really like, by the way. Uh, their their past year podcasts have been kind of shit. Not gonna lie, in terms of audio quality alone, I will call well, them out for this. There Julian, go. I'm gonna take you on a, on a little cruise here because sure. I'm gonna go to the to the fridge and pull Sick. something out for myself. All right. Well, my point was their audio. You know, I mean, when you have a voice chat online, it it is what it is, right? You ha you get that little hiccup. You're on, especially if you're on Wi-Fi. Mm -hmm. uh, you get that hiccup, and the and then there's like the, the distortion. It's hard to uh, animate it with my voice. But they they don't fucking record their audio separately, as we do on Audacity for a totally free program. <laughs> <laughs> that you can download That's on stupid. any computer, including Macs. Uh, and it's just like super easy to do anything <laughs> related to audio with this program. You we, can it doesn't have, have that hiccup. We've also been in a podcast recording age for a couple years now. Yeah. Where literally uh, idiots like me can can exactly. figure out how to record a podcast so all i'm so, saying is ign has full-time editors of their podcast you guys couldn't get the you have what they have usually four people on this podcast i don't know well maybe you know what three or four if just you send you the audio files white listed them <laughs> if you had whitelisted IGN so they could get ad revenue, they would be able to afford those microphones. Oh, but yeah. because you haven't whitelisted them, it's true. You don't get ad it's revenue. It's not even the microphones. It's just like, come on, record your audio on the hard drive and then send it to how, the editor. How can they? How can they do this Very, all at once? Oh, to, uh, four people clapping? Impossible. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. It's IGN. never happened in the history. Like the epitome. You, you've heard people who have to rhythmically clap in america yeah. they're just like at the first four claps on time while the guy's like here's here's what we're doing here's and then as soon as the guy doing. on stage stops they got assholes who are going on the off beats or like accelerating it it's terrible like that's how would you get four people to clap at a single time with one countdown to sync up the audio impossible Unbelievable. Is all I have to say. 